Hello, my dear learners! Welcome back to our TLE class. I am Teacher Melissa, Grade 7 TLE teacher. Join me as we learn new lesson in TLE 7 Nail Care Services. Make sure that you are holding or reading your module in TLE. Now, let us compare these two pictures. This is picture 1. This is picture 2. Can you see the difference? Very good! Picture 1 shows a messy nail salon while picture 2 shows a clean and disinfected nail salon. Now, why do we need to clean our nail salon? Very good! Nail salons need to be disinfected and clean to avoid the spread of germs and microorganisms. Our topic for today is Perform basic preventive and corrective maintenance. Here are the objectives that you will be able to meet at the end of the lesson. Number one, identify and inspect defective tools and equipment. Number two, clean tools and equipment according to standard procedures. And number three, Value the importance of cleaning tools and equipment according to standard procedures. It is vital to sterilize metal implements, sanitize wooden tools, disinfect hand and foot spa machines as well as environmental surfaces before and after its use. Contaminated tools can cause bacterial and fungal infections that are unsightly, painful, and sometimes fatal. There are several methods of cleaning and sterilization. Do a rapid cleaning after each nail care service and deep clean monthly to keep tools safe and useful all the time. Here are the five ways or means to keep tools and equipment safe and functional. Number 1. Sterilize metal implements after its use in a hospital-grade disinfectant that is bactericidal, virucidal, and fungicidal. This disinfectant can be found in beauty supply stores. Immerse the tools in the disinfectant for 10 minutes. Number 2. Disinfect foot basins after each use with a bleach solution. Make a 1 to 10 ratio solution by mixing 1 part bleach with 10 parts of water. Using gloves, rinse the basin with the solution to disinfect. If necessary, scrub with a detergent to remove any dirt or debris. Number 3. Use a boiling method of sterilization once a month to disinfect all metal implements. Designate one pot for sterilization to prevent cross-contamination with food. Submerge the tools in boiling water for 10 minutes. Drain the tools and allow them to dry. Number 4. Store sterilized metal implements in an airtight, zipper-sealed bags to keep them from being exposed to dirt and bacteria. Be sure tools are completely dry before storing them. 
If waiting more than a couple of weeks before the next nail care service, sterilize the tools again before use. Number 5. Inspect tools and equipment regularly to identify defective ones for repair, replacement, or condemnation. Here are some ways in keeping the workplace clean and safe. Number one, all beauty salons must be well lighted and well ventilated and must be in good sanitary condition. Number two, the salon premises must be free from rodents, vermin, flies, or other similar insects. Number three, all salon establishments must be provided with continuous running hot and cold water. Number four, the curtains and floor coverings in the salon must be washable and kept clean. Number five, all hair, nail clippings, used cotton, or other waste materials must be removed from the floor immediately and deposited in a closed container. Get rid of them from the salon premises at frequent intervals. Number six, the restrooms must be well sanitized and be provided with individual towels. Number 7. Each beautician must wear a washable uniform while working on clients. Number 8. Each client must be provided with a freshly laundered towel. Number 9. All waste materials should be disposed of in an enclosed waste bin fitted with polythene bin liner, durable enough to resist tearing. Class, we are done with our discussion. Let me check if you truly understand our lesson. Read the following measures in keeping the salon clean and in a safe state. Choose thumbs up if it is a good practice and thumbs down if it is not. Number 1. Each client must be provided with a freshly laundered towel. The correct answer is thumbs up. Number 2. All waste materials should be disposed of in an open waste bin. The correct answer is thumbs down because it says open waste bin. Number three, the curtains and floor coverings in the salon must be washable and clean. The correct answer is thumbs up. Number four, the salon premises must be free from flies or other similar insects. The correct answer is thumbs up. Number five, all beauty salons must be well lighted and well ventilated and must be poor in sanitary condition. The correct answer is thumbs down because of the word poor. Number six. Beauticians can wear their uniforms for three days without washing them.
The correct answer is thumbs down. Number 7. All salon establishments must be provided with continuous running hot and cold water. The correct answer is thumbs up. Number 8. Disinfect foot basins with a bleach solution once a month. The correct answer is thumbs down because it should be disinfected after each use. Number 9. The restrooms must be well sanitized and be provided with individual towels. The correct answer is thumbs up. Number 10. Each client must be provided with a slightly used towel. The correct answer is thumbs down because of the word slightly used. I hope you learned a lot today and you are all ready to answer all the activities in your TLE module. Again, this is Teacher Melissa, Grade 7 TLE Teacher. See you next time!